from south of the border. Nice to have you along. Welcome to an evening of Northwestern Wildcat basketball. It's the 2022 Cancun Challenge. The Northwestern Wildcats take on the flames of Liberty University. The Wildcats are off to a 4-0 start, holding opponents to 33% shooting. That is first in the Big Ten, ninth nationally. The winner will take on the 13th ranked Auburn Tigers tomorrow for the championship. Ready to go, hope you enjoy it from Cancun, Mexico. Cats just have to keep their calm now, not get frantic, they're down by nine. That's not a big deficit to overcome. Draudis draws the double, gets it to Nicholson, double clutch, puts it up, count it, and a foul. Here's Brockheiser the other way, drives to the basket, layup, good and one. Audige out front, holds and looks. Beats Barron, quick release three, good Robbie Barron. Cats gaining a little momentum and doing it with their defense and then capitalizing on the offensive end. Highbury gets the Cats within two. The Cats head for the locker room down by a point. 29-28. Good, good. We saw we can do. Now let's just let's respond. Yep, yep. It's a 20-minute game. We gotta run. We know they're good, right? We're playing good teams. You gotta beat good teams. Lock in and put 20 minutes together. Okay, come on. Let's go. That's on a 13-2 run down the first half. We've got quite a game here in Cancun. One point lead for Liberty. Gaudis goes inside there. Verhoeven curling to the basket. Two hand dunk. Barry scoops a shot up, scores, and a foul. Jump pass inside, curling to the basket. Nicholson with a two hand dunk, and the Cats are up seven. This has just been gutsy play by the Cats here. Highbury looks for Audige, open three, right side angle, yes! Chase Audige, what a big shot! And a steal of Barnheiser, drives to the basket, throws it down with the right hand. And the Wildcats will play for the championship here tomorrow night. What a great effort, Dave. Just can't say enough about this team and the effort this evening. I got two aces of spades tonight, though. Two aces of spades. Very first one, uh, the Energizer Bunny, Ty Berry. Ty! The second one, I just thought this guy was unbelievable the whole night and just played like a great, great player, Chase Hunt. Yes, Family on three, one, two, three. Family. Update here in Cancun. We got our uh, first win last night against Liberty. It was a big time win for us. Um, now we're really looking forward to play against number 13 Auburn tonight. The week's been been great. Um, first day we got up here was a, was a great day for us to you know enjoy the the weather and the, the beach and um, all the amenities here at the resort. Now uh, here getting ready to play against Auburn, we're, we're really locked in and we don't have a lot of time now to, to enjoy the sun or the, the um, beach or any of that, so um, now it's, it's, it's business all the way through. All right guys. <laughs> guys, this is what you work for. This is why we're there all summer. This is why we do all that, to play in championship games against good teams. And I say this all the time, and as you go out on the floor, when you're preparing to play in those games, do you prepare thinking of yourself being weak-minded and soft and not being strong? Hell no, you don't. 
You go into that thinking, I'm gonna win, I'm gonna play great, we're gonna play great, and we're gonna play together. And that's what we need to do tonight. All right? So, so let's go. Well, the Cats are playing for a championship here tonight. A very tough task facing them, however, against the number 13 team in the country and the defending Southeastern Conference champions. They play a very aggressive style of basketball. It's going to be a physical game. And because they're ranked number 13, this is incentive for the Cats to come out now and be able to capture a signature win. has a breakaway. Adiz to the rim, throws it down with two hands, and the Cats are within one, 22-21. Ball knocked away, Bowie's got it, numbers for the Cats. Drives in, lays it up and in. I mean, this has just been a magnificent game to watch. The strength and grit of the Wildcats here against the 13th ranked Auburn Tigers. Tigers have scored nine straight. Nicholson gets it out to Barry. Barry will try out three. Good! Fresh shot clock here. 533 left. Bowie drives in, little floater. Good! This is a great game to watch here. There's Nicholson for a dunk, and we're tied. Time out, Auburn. Down to three minutes for the game. Ten to shoot. Ornij, a three for the lead. Good! Chase Ornij! Barry is going to throw it in left sideline. 12.8 to go 12 on the shot clock. 43-42 Auburn. Barry looking, goes to Barrett. Hands to Adige. Down to eight to shoot. Chase Adige. Trouble with his footing, puts up a jumper, no good. Rebound tipped around, loose on the floor. And that's it. Time has expired. Auburn has won it. A heartbreaking loss for the Wildcats in this championship game, the Cancun Challenge. You learn from your adversity in life. That, that's, that's for certain. And, and this one, a game they certainly could have won, but they've got to come away from this understanding that they can play with any team in the country. That's the message you have to take away from a loss like this. I mean, last night was really rough, to be honest. Like, a lot of plays, I know a lot of guys wish they would have had back. I mean, me personally, on that last uh, last play, there's definitely a lot of things I probably would have done differently. But, I mean, at the end of the day, like, we really left it all out there. Like, it was such, it was a fun game to play, and just got to move on and, you know, learn from it. I think we got so much potential as a team and just, you know, individuals, and I think we're really going to grow from this and just get a lot better. I think it's going to be, it's going to be fun to watch and fun to play in the next few games. It wasn't that bad. It looked worse than it was. <laughs>